Now to the major fraud case involving a quarter of a billion dollars in taxpayer money. Dozens of people under arrest accused of stealing $250 million in funds that were supposed to help feed children during the pandemic. Andrew Dimmert has a story. Good morning, Andrew. Good morning, George. This is the largest pandemic related fraud scheme yet. $250 million meant for meals for low income children, instead used to make luxury purchases like cars, homes and jewelry. Federal investigators charging 48 people in Minnesota with conspiracy and other serious counts. Many of the companies involved were sponsored by a nonprofit called Feeding Our Future. The organization's founder, Amy Bach, was among those indicted. And here's how prosecutors say this scam went down. They alleged the perpetrators claimed to be offering food for tens of thousands of kids across Minnesota, then tried to get reimbursed by the government for those meals. Only few meals were ever even served, according to authorities. Instead, the defendants supposedly used the COVID kickbacks to fund a lavish lifestyle. And by the way, the U.S. attorney for Minnesota says the $250 million the conspirators ripped off from the government is just the, quote, floor, and they may have stolen even more. George. Oh my goodness. Okay, Andrew, thanks very much. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.